Good day to everyone. We are going to look at this question. And when you see this question, they talk about the mean age of workers. A worker in the company is this. At the end of the promotion in a company, three workers ages are this 2019 and 19 were not promoted. The new age of the workers in the company became 18 volt number one on three. Calculate the number of workers in the company before the main, before the promotion. So here we will say that let let the number of workers let the number of workers before promotion. Or promotion equal to N. And let the ages of workers equal to total ages of workers equal to X. The mean has been given to us as X on N because anytime we talk about mean average, so we divide the total number of ages, the total ages by the total number of workers. So we equate it and then we make as the subject. After that, we find the total ages for the three, the total ages for the three, the three workers that were not promoted. We fit the age. From then the new mean now becomes this. Because you have to subtract the total ages from the one. From X. The total ages for the three from X. And you are left with. 3 minus n minus 3. That gives you the that gives you the what? The number of workers left. And that means that we can equate the new mean to this. That is what we have done. When we change this one to mix improper fraction, we get this. So at this stage, we can simplify this equation. We now have equation 2, equation 1. So we substitute equation 2. Equation 1 into equation 2. In doing that, we will have wherever we see x, we put 18.4. So we have 5, 5, n minus 3 equal to 3. That can open 18.4 and minus 5 is. So with this one, we can expand the brackets. So we have 55 and minus. 165 equal to this multiply by this you get 55 point and use your calculator to point you get it 0.2 and minus this multiply by this 174 at this stage we group like it so we can decide to maintain this and take this to this side so take this one to this side so I have 5 5 0.2 and minus 5, 5 and equal to ne equal to 174 minus 165. The result here will give me 0 0.2 and equal to what will you get? You get something like 9. Is that okay? Good. So divide through by 0 on 2, 0 on 2. This implies that n will be equal to 45. So this tells you that the number of workers in a company before the, before the promotion was 45 workers. Thank you very much for watching. Wish to see you another time.